what a sunny day. And it's a beautiful and day. Seattle, well, and Seattle, uncommon. <laughs> yeah, this is uncommon. And well, we waited long enough so that now we will have a few days. Yeah. It's going to be like this. We hope we'll have a nice weather, especially in the Yellowstone Park. Yeah, that's right. Where it's very, very cold right now. Yeah, it's cold now. It's about it 40. 40? Yeah, 40 or 60, not more. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's chilly. <laughs> chilly. Yeah. We want some, even it's chilly. Glacier. Oh yeah. And we we are on June, so June like. This is gonna be June. That's right. So there's a beautiful city. Yeah. And you will take 90 yes. east. Ninety. There's a ski area. Uh huh. Yep. So we are going now uh, northeast or? We're going southeast. Southeast. We're going southeast. So we'll, where where we are going? So we're going to go from Seattle to Yakima. Over, why why there? Well, Yakima. We're going to Yakima to visit my friend Frank. Ah. And so Frank is an old friend from Nashville, Tennessee, and I haven't seen him for fifty years. Fifty five zero. Five zero. I oh. haven't seen him since wow. high school. Ah, so this is grapes here. Uh huh. Mm. Should should we to try the um, um, Washington is. wine? We are thinking about that. So show people right. their result yeah. here. Yeah. And we are in the canyon. Uh -huh. It's a very uh, different canyon uh, I have seen from uh, all the it's, America. It's a very gently shaped canyon. Yes. That's right. So this canyon has basalt flows on its walls, left and right. Big, tall, level levels of uh, basalt which have been eroded down many years by this nice river and unlike some canyons like the Grand Canyon in a quarter mile yeah. turn right the bridge is moving a little bit well it's a suspension bridge it's held up here with cables yeah yeah it's what it's moving <laughs> <laughs> So this is the Yakima River, this is the Yakima Canyon, and this is the, one of the first railroad tracks that laid down in this part of Washington. Maybe we can fish with Frank, no? Maybe we can go fishing with Frank? Maybe. And I like fish. Up here we have all these basalt lava flows forming the canyon. Oh, uh, yeah. How beautiful this is. Oh, look at this green uh, nature. Uh -huh. Hey! What? Hello! Have a dog. Okay, hi there. This is a transcontinental railway. If you go that way, you get to the Atlantic Ocean. If you go that way, you get to the Pacific Ocean. Oh, interesting. Yeah. And which way we are going? We're going that way. We're going that way, at least towards Montana. We're not going to go all the way to New York. But, uh, yeah, if you saw a train coming along here, you could jump on the train and, and in a few days you'd be in New York. How many days? This is not a TGV. It's no. not a French or a Japanese no, train. This, this is not the fast train. Uh, it might be a week. Yeah. It might be a week. And Maybe it will be uh, um, faster uh, by car. It will be faster to get there by car, that's right. Touch it. I just want to, to see the bridge. The bridge is very nice. Yeah. <laughs> okay, how is the water? Wet? Ah, oh, it's actually nice. It's not so cold. Not so cold? No. <laughs> You're running. <laughs> actually, if you don't know, uh, Nick is doing exercise. Every day in the morning, he's doing uh, uh, some of yoga, very personal exercising. Here in Yakima Canyon, especially up in that canyon there, there are a lot of beavers. And uh, these beavers are native to North America, and they are the construction engineers of the mountains and the lakes and they they use their teeth 
Mm -hmm. They're big, sharp teeth to cut down trees. When they've knocked the trees down, they then build dams across the river. And inside of these lakes that they create, they build houses where they can live in safety because they, they make themselves a little island inside the river. And um, it's an aquatic mammal. Yeah. Um, and they have a big tail and they use the tail for swimming. Um, snakes! Oh, and then the other animals that we were just told about are the rattlesnakes. So uh, native to these hills are rattlesnakes, which uh, they're poisonous. But the good Very thing, po poisonous. Uh, they, they can kill you, yes. Yes. And uh, when, uh, before a rattlesnake bites you, he will rattle with his tail. And that's your warning that maybe you should back up, go away. Yeah. And uh, that's a good thing, the rattlesnake. Nice He'll animal. tell you, go now. <laughs> yeah, go now. He's telling you to go now. That's right. <laughs> No passing. I know, right? No apples. Don't pass. It's apples. Is it apples? Yeah. Okay. But how interesting they put. Wow. Yeah. Huh. Maybe Moldovan and Romanian should uh, take example of this kind of agriculture. Huh. Yeah. There's a huge sign. Wow, yeah. Okay. You have there. I like this spot. Uh, this is not the spot. Okay, it's not a spot. Okay, talk. come on. Well, but it's sort of tight. There is another one. Okay, go over there. <laughs> oh, yummy, yummy stuff. It seems like very local products here. You see? Spe oh. spe special food. Special stuff. Yeah. yeah. Alright, that really drinks special. I don't know what is blueberry jam, wild blueberry jam. Maybe we can have Washington wine there. Okay, I think maybe. Alright, let's get oh, Interesting place, I like it. Wow, so many things. Oh, how is this? Oh, this is from Yakima. Look at this. I didn't know uh, the peanuts uh, uh, in uh, Yakima. Uh huh. Okay. You Yakima see? Peanuts. I think we get some good snack food here. Oh, look at this, very funny. Yeah. Big food. Oh, Bigfoot wines. Yeah, okay, yeah. We Bigfoot in uh, Washington? Do we have Bigfoot in Washington? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And Lots which states? Um, the western states, the northwestern states. Uh, so it's uh, Washington, Oregon, Idaho, Montana. Those are the places where people think they see uh, Bigfoot. Also, of course, Alaska and British Columbia. Yeah, Alaska, yeah, because I remember. Bigfoot, Bigfoot lives in the mountains, in the forests. Yes. Yeah, so that's where the Bigfoot is, so we got Bigfoot wine. All the maps I like this, uh, those kind of a bridge. I know, and, and it's nice only, uh, I saw in Washington. Uh -huh. I don't know if there is everywhere like that. There's Frank. <laughs> hey Frank, how you doing? Good, Good to see you. 
after how many years? How many years has it been since I've seen you? That's right, you did come visit me in the 90s in San Francisco, so it's only been 25 years. <laughs> you double! <laughs> yeah, 50 year old bike. Right. Old Colorado Springs plate. Uh huh. This was my upgrade that I got secondhand from a good triathlete, but it's probably a 35 year old bike. Yeah. That is my triathlon racing bike. Okay. Uh, not that it does much different. Uh, it was Cervelo before Cervelo got cool and started winning. Okay. Tour de France. Oh, wait. Look oh, at this. you did Tour de France? Like uh, the. Okay, now, okay. So, Natalia, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I told you he was an athlete. Look at this. Yeah, that's. I was like impressed when I saw all this. Uh... Speaking of 50 year old stuff, these cups are from the Green Hills Relay. <gasps> You're at the Green Hills Relay. I have one of those. <gasps> wow, and this one. And then that photo was taken by Don Curry. Yeah, okay. This. That's at uh, David Liscomb. Oh, what is this? Sorry, Frank. You're yeah, right I'm in the middle. Yeah, okay. Space what is Frank. this? Uh, that's from my 24 uh, hour PR where I got almost 83 miles. 83 Bicycle? miles? Bicycle? No, running. Running how, mu how much? 24 hours. 24 hours if without I... stopping? Uh, no, I took a long nap in the middle. <laughs> you ran 83 miles in 24 hours. I That's cannot pretty, imagine. Pretty good. Yeah. Oh. And then there's a from that's from that that certificate's from high school. That's right. What's the date on this? This is. Oops. Oh no! No! You no. ruined it! Oh no! <laughs> okay, wait, 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 Frank. I'm sorry. I, I, October thirteenth, nineteen seventy. Okay. Uh, uh, and uh, th this is only a participant ribbon. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> don't don't give him more wine or or, or don't, beer. Don't touch him. <laughs> Are you ready for for beer? Actually, I don't know where we are going. I uh, I heard about something about uh, beer and the Mexican food. <laughs> where? Right. Down here, see the red truck? Oh yeah. That's where we're having. Oh, dinner. so the brewery at the uh, right and the That's where red we get taco. Our beer and then we have our tacos. Oh, oh good. <laughs> about brewery? Oh no, about um, about about this. Yes. All right. So. We're here at uh, a brewery in, East, in Eastern Washington, and uh, let's see, correct me if I'm wrong, this is where all the hops in America come from that makes most the beer. Of them. Most, most of them. Most of, the, most of the hops in America, all the stuff that's used for making beer comes from here. The stuff that makes the, the beer have its bite, that comes from here. Okay. And the craft brew part of industry it. really depends on these various uh, varieties of, of hops and uh, if you taste one and then taste the other, you can really tell the difference. The difference in the hops. There we go. Here we go. And then when we're done, we'll have Mexican food over here at the truck. Yeah. I'm starving. Starving? And I, I'm, I'm thirsty on the... <laughs> I'm hungry. Hungry. Well... You can have one that measures. You can have one that smells good. Do you have dual purpose ones? But just because something says 100 IBU doesn't mean it's going to be bitter in your face. An IBU is an international bitter unit. Well, we have our 241 stuff every night. You want to do something like that? Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Give her a I'll ten. A, a ten of a so surprise. Yeah. Sounds good. I can do that. Okay. Full I can bump it up to a twelve. Let's try the surprise beer. Hmm. I like. Yes. So mine and I can have some of yours and okay. some of Frank's. Look at this. Look at that. Mm. 
and, I like Mexican food. Oh yeah, and now this is this is one hot sauce, and that's the other hot sauce. Yeah. Mm, it smells good. It smells beans. Yeah. It smells very nice. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. <laughs> Oh, they what, what what is this? Yeah, that that's a small cone that's about to develop. That's oh, that's yeah, that, that's that's, the... that's what that makes the beer. Yeah. Okay. And that they'll put together in a real mash. You know. Wow. Yeah, yeah, it's too early for cherries here. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's too cold. Well, the logo is from the newspaper in Nashville. Ah. Uh, this is a Washington wine, huh? Yep. Do you like? It's an unknown Chardonnay from... I see a lot of stuff here. here. So, uh, so it's good to come see on you. back anytime, y'all. Yeah, y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs> thank you very much, thank you very much. Okay. Betty. It was a great time, safe, even safe, short, yeah. but great. Sure. It was very nice. Safe travels. All right, good, here we go. Let's go see those wild horses. <laughs> the, horse, the horse sculptures. That's, right. ah. That's where we're going, right? <laughs> exactly where we're going. All right. Thanks again. Great to <laughs> see you. <laughs> yeah, that was a wonderful spot. All right. Let's go. Okay, Google Maps. Look at this beautiful day again. Yeah, nice day, yeah. Today, today you're going to cross Washington, cross Idaho, and go into Montana. And it's a big, a long, long way. We have a long way to 19 go. Nineteen hours. It depends um, how often driving. we are. Uh, also, we are. We are right. Continue on Summit View but Avenue. It's for not half seven o'clock in the morning, so we got a nice early start. Yeah, six fifty-three. Six fifty-three, and we're pulling out of here. All right, that'll work. If I were going to do it again. It's a good view on the Columbia River. Yeah, look at this. Those flowers. They're beautiful. Yeah, impressive. They're very delicate. Mm, yeah. We're standing here on top of a hill next to Interstate 90 and the Columbia River. And an artist named David Go Goldevere, 
um, came in here in 1889 and directed 16 horses, uh, wild horses, galloping across the top of the hill. Uh, a romantic, windswept, desolate location, uh, home to these horses. Beautiful spot, nice spot. Uh, most cars just drive right on by and miss this beautiful sight. Welcome to George. Washington. This is the town of George Washington. After this, we'll have to go visit Joe Montana. <laughs> Here we are. Nick, are you impressed by Washington State? I have, uh, my eyes have been open. I had no idea that there were there were canyons like this in Washington. Yeah. Uh, and these uh, beautiful basalt cliffs on both sides of us are spectacular. Uh, and we've got the uh, Grand Coulee Lake in between these two sets of cliffs. Yeah. It's really quite beautiful. the largest hydroelectric power producer in the United States. And it's also one of the largest concrete structures in the world. Impressive. I'm impressed because I visited the Hoover Dam and I thought it was the largest one because I think it's higher. Uh, yes, Hoover Dam is higher. Yes. That's, but it's I narrower. But this is producing more electricity and it's producing electricity that goes to 11 states. Pretty big. Yeah, yeah, this goes nuts. Uh-huh. Yep. 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 It's just, gosh, it's tears. Yeah. Where are you guys from? Maine. Maine? Oh! Where in Maine? Portland. Portland. Yeah. I, I know where it's Portland. I, I uh, Portland? flew there. Yes, yes. Right? From Portland uh, to um, uh, Harbor, uh, to Bar Harbor. Bar Harbor. Yeah. What did you think of Maine? Like Maine? <gasps> Wonderful. Nice, yeah. It's like a... Um, a piece, uh, for me, it was very similar with uh, Britannia, Britain in 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 France. Yeah, the vegetation and uh, yeah, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. and yes. the best ever uh, lobster. Oh, of course. Okay, of course yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I uh, spent uh, last fall and last winter in Lewiston. Oh, you did. My cousin lives in Lewiston. No, I have lots cousin of Christmas. friends in Lewiston. No, I've got friends all friends and family all over there. That's wonderful. That's why I was in you don't know any Del Rossi's, do you? Oh, look at all this building stuff. <laughs> it's very good. Beautiful to do this, like yeah. you drive through the, the flowers. Flowers. <laughs> really beautiful flowers.
It's just a garden. A natural garden. That's right. So we are not anymore in the Indian uh, reservation? No, we've left the Indian reservation, which was really beautiful. And now we're back on a very scenic highway that will take us all the way to Plains, Montana. And we were right there um, around 7. Around uh, 7, yeah. yeah. I enjoy so much this ride. There are so many flowers and flowers. This is springtime. So back, back of the we are uh, twenty. How much? Twenty-four, twenty-seven miles from to Canada. Oh! 